Oh, hi, hello, yes. So you're fine. Hey everybody, welcome in, I'm Ever, and today we are watching episodes three and four of Amphibia, and with the last couple of episodes, I am looking super forward to these episodes. If you guys enjoy the video, don't forget to subscribe so that we can come back and watch the episodes day one, and if you're interested in catching the entirety of season two early, because it's all recorded and done, you can get access to that by becoming a patron with the link down below, which will also give you access to our Patreon exclusive show, Steven Universe. But without anything else, let's go ahead and watch episodes three and four. Oh, the music's giving me like Halloween kind of vibes, which as we probably all know at this point, I sure love my Halloween episodes. Uh, no. I think that this is Polly's episode two, so that should be... I didn't like that. No. Sorry, Polly, but no. I was up all night driving and I really need to sleep. Please, Can't like up. Sprig read it or something? You know? <sighs> I guess Aww. one story couldn't hurt. Hop on up, little camper. No. Oh. Here we go. I love Fergus how Polly Frog is like so tough and everything. And then also, you know, he's like, oh, I want story time. You know, it's like a nice, it's a very nice uh, duality. It's a pop pop pop! Whoa! Hey! Sprig! Which way? Left or right? Uh, uh, right! No left! Uh, oh! Ah. Oh, the book! Oh, Polly! Polly just wanted story time and now... All of this. Got left. Uh, 28, 29... Boom! I'm filthy! What the heck, dude? Hey, I'm <laughs> Wait, how did you get so filthy? Give me a bath! Oh, no, not inside! Ah, Kremeny. Polly is gonna get she made in trouble mess. so hard. Come on, kids. I'm too tired for this. If you're tired, Hop Hop, I know what'll wake you up. Zap tag! Just gotta fill up the car again? Polly, no, it's wet <laughs> it's in here. wet, yeah. yeah. Hop Hop is always getting beat up, dude. Polly. He's always getting beat up. Man, what's with Polly today? Huh? Is it just me or is she oh. being extra annoying? I know. Zap tag? More like zap pest. They can't all be Why are you being Maybe so she's mean just not to her? <sighs> it's times like these when I wonder whether I should have left her with Mrs. Croker back home in Wardwood. Dude, okay, what they're saying is actually really mean. Okay, you don't mean that. You're like, just a little frustrated. Yeah, I'm sure she's got her reasons. You guys you're also right, said right. mean things. Just it so don't make it sound like he's the only one that said mean things. You all just said them. Oh, well, we'll just talk to her when she wakes up then. Never. So she's just gonna... <laughs> they see that oh, coming, she looks so gonna weird without the little bow. And then they're gonna come so odd. Back. Also sounds like you have a problem revealing vulnerability, even to those closest to you. <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> totally. Jesus mm -hmm. Christ. What the Truckers would be all grumpy and agree with me. What's not these ones. The no. Movies? Well, when you spend a lot of time on the road alone, there's not much to do but better yourself. I just got my PhD. Up top, sister. Hey, did any of y'all take the big purple stone that was by the door no here? No high fiving. Uh, maybe. Why? Because it weren't no stone. It oh, was the God, egg of egg. a rock. A giant flesh-eating ravenous bird was about to sell the bugger to the circus down the way. Someone must have pinched it. Too bad for them, though, because that bird's gonna devour the first frog it sees <laughs> once it hatches. <laughs> oh, Which God. should be in about five. What the? Spring, hop up! Code purple! What? <laughs> she must be in the truck stop. I think, we can, we, can we remove the egg from the... Well, that's mildly concerning. Yes. Anything? Not yet. Wait up! I think I see them! Looks like they're totally fine. Ooh. Are they just gonna go right past them? Hey, fam! I'm right here! <gasps> oh, that's a big boy. Is that one of the creatures from the finale? Last season? I can't remember what they looked like. I think it is, though. Hey, those were expensive. Get up and go faster! Yes, ma'am. Now it's a place! charge. Yeah, incredible. Absolutely excellent. Polly, I love Polly. Polly's energy is unparalleled. Welcome. I'd also like to thank Speedy Joe for his Speedy Joe. Thanks, buddy. 
Uh-oh, full name. No, Could you give us apologize. No, they're going to apologize. You got it. 100%. So, sorry about the killer bird. Forget the killer bird. Don't you ever run away from us again, you hear me? We were worried sick. Yeah. What if something okay, happened apology, to you? Like, what if you had gotten it. hurt or lost or worse? I really am just trouble, aren't I? You oh. are right. Maybe you should. Polly. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, you heard, she heard that, yeah. Heard all that, did you? Yeah. Polly. Well, well, do you guys need a tow to the next stop? Bet you they'll have everything you need to fix up your wagon. Yeah, the what? wagon's probably a word? decimated well, now right now. now that we got a breather, who's ready for story time? Fragon. Yeah, I'm 13, Fra but okay. Wagon? I don't even know what the, I don't even know what the, what they're saying, honestly. Yeah. Before I was a farm frog, your hot pop had dreams. Next life, I suppose. No, of course. Here we <laughs> Yeah, we gotta go. It's time to definitely go. You sand. Hey, you! Head towards that dune. We got a caravan on the other side. Is this, and this a, thing is this a dune? Is this a dune parody? We're doing a dune parody, aren't we? Your own. Haven't you ever read Fear the Dry Swamp? You know that play? Know it? Ha! I directed it. Renee again. Rogers, the name and managing <laughs> this acting troupe is my game. Oh. An acting troupe. Here? I don't wow. think. What are the chances? Hop and die. We've got places Why to don't you be, folks brother. join our caravan? We could use the extra stagehands, and you know what they Love say. Her voice. Safety She's numbers. got that, like, you know, Where that entertainer's voice. Welcome to our humble of the, operation. Of the 1900s. It was awful. And this place oh, okay. is bringing back memories. I'm a tooth. That's the truth. <laughs> Four to five dentists agree. I was traumatized. Shh. Anyways, see you Dentist, later. Dentist, dude, you almost just burned a bunch of children, and I think that that's a little more, you know, problematic. Good heart. Someone like you, actually. Too bad hmm. you're not an actor. <coughs> he, 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 actually, he can be. I am. Papa is, you know, that's an so. actor. Huh. You want to audition? Hark! For I am homeless. I am friendless. I am... Hello? Stop. You're hitting the animation. Me, but you're not knocking me out. When they you know give I mean? them like extra lines no. and everything on you're their face and just oh. really accent that, literally Super. that. Guess when they do that either. and accentuate the face and everything, it is my absolute favorite of this show. Huh? Who's Polly, Governor? Oh, I'm Lydia Davenport, the Black Widow. Ignore him, Lydia. He clearly the doesn't have Widow. enough in character. <laughs> Oh, you're straight. Yeah, she's not gonna help. Yeah, no, she's gonna join in. Sad is no one you'll never be more than a vegetable farmer. Oh. But you know what? I'd still rather be sad is this, and have a dream. Is she gonna count this as acting? Because, I mean, this is kind of coming from the heart. It's not really acting. Now that's what I've been looking for. It's not Theater acting, though. is that's, truth, that's, and baby, you just that's from the heart. a heaping spoonful. You got the lead part, Hoppadaya. Huh, that's not acting, though. Now let's what get this you... show on the road. No, that's Literally. not his face radio. Oh, come on! Thank you. Thank you. I mean, Hoppadaya deserves some love, too, right? He's always trying to do the right thing, with the exception of burying the music box, but, you know... We don't know why he's done that yet. So, we travel from town to town, and while people are transfixed by our amazing place, Blammo, we take what we deserve. <laughs> Blammo! But this is wrong! Yeah. What's wrong is how underappreciated wrong, the arts but... are. Besides, we only take what we need. As somebody who is in band and who very much appreciates that lead. schools should Every have more art programs. Price, am I right? Agreed. Well, 100%. The, we'll see you the art programs for the big night. are incredibly underappreciated. And we should fund them more. Bam! Simple as that. The play's a distraction. You can disagree with me or not, but if you disagree, you're not right. <laughs> you know what, Francois? I'm sick of this. Keep your snotty attitude and your dumb accent. I'm out. There you go, buddy. Thank you. It's not acting. It's not acting. Now, it's not acting. Jesus in. Christ! It's not. I don't think that they know what acting is, honestly. I'm not convinced. <laughs> Right, boys, that's our cue. Right. Everyone, this is a sham. They're robbing you blind. The jig is up, boys. Every frog for themselves. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Just on top of the whole, the whole crowd. We gotta get away. Now, what's Hoppa dying gonna do? He's gonna. Oh. Finally. Ah! We tried. 
He's right there. Oh. Worm yeah! thing had to. What about your big it had break? to come back. Your dream. That's the thing about dreams, Renee. Sooner okay. or later, you gotta wake up. Oh, oh, no, I don't. Ooh, I don't like that. That's the thing about dreams. You've got to wake up. And that's insinuating that like you shouldn't dream. I feel I don't like that line. I feel like that's insinuating like yeah, to give up on your dreams because eventually you've got to just get real. Hey, looks like we're almost halfway to Utopia HP. Wow. Yep, yeah, this this adventure is going say, much quicker than I thought it was going to be. A lot smoother than I thought it'd be. <laughs> yep. But the yeah. one thing I one I'm spring. Look at all this dumb moss I I've uh, wow. just now wow. made an executive wow. decision to start standing for reactions. I've been able to do that for the longest time. But I feel like this is going to be better. We'll just, we'll see. Mark this, mark this as an episode where things change. Pass. A road to reconciliation for weary travel mates. Okay, so what? Wait, weary uh, travel mates. Gonna... It's so funny oh, how, like, what? sometimes just they get along and then other here? times it's just, oh, they're literally, I mean, that's it siblings. Right here it's that the literally siblings. Like, the way that they have portrayed the them. You brought this upon yourself. I, I have two brothers. It was exactly the same way. You know, sometimes you get along and sometimes you just... Bother the hell out of each other. Try to keep up, Skull Poke! Oh, no, you don't! I, I think what I'm gonna... I feel like what I dislike about this episode so far is that it's definitely saying, like, hey, they're gonna work together and get through this. But I think the issue is gonna be more so, like... It won't last. Like, I'm sure that they're still gonna have fights and everything, you know? But that's just my guess, at least. It's always with the saving tongue, dude. Thanks. Every time. Oh, remember? Think... And the only way we got across was <gasps> the walk and roll. Oh yeah, look, they're already genius. working together. You'd love to see it. <sighs> Forgot where I was. Let's roll and walk. Already working together. That did not take long at all. I'm actually kind of surprised. Yeah. Right, left, right, left. Yeah. left. Yeah. <laughs> nice. We First did. obstacle down. Now let's breeze through. It wasn't like I the, wasn't the worst that. obstacle, what honestly. What are doing without us? Finally, peace and quiet. Almost too a little quiet. too quiet. Yeah, too quiet. No, you get used to the noise. <laughs> Almost a little awkward, isn't it? <laughs> so, do you have a boyfriend back home? Ow! They call us the impossible two. Why does that even? Why was that? This is for, why was that the question to ask? Oh, he's gonna land on our feet. We're almost there. Okay, not much farther. Hopefully. Uh, oh. oh, oops, my bad. Ah, watch for your putting your he big. He said dumb sorry. Face. You. He what said you sorry. Put your big dumb spit. Uh, you're so annoying. No, you are. No, you are. No, you are. No, you are. We were so close. Success. So we were like this close to success. Good one. Hi. <laughs> Whoops. Didn't mean to frighten you. That's okay. I meant to eat you. <laughs> Wait, are you going to eat them? Or... Okay. Yeah. For dessert. <laughs> Dude, the way there's bones everywhere. Oh, that's a lot of bones. Like the well, way that they just have bones time. everywhere. Insi I mean, obviously insinuating well, the death of yeah, how I many of these frogs. Like frogs are just dying, dude. Ah, good. <laughs> we lost him in the crack because you were dragging your feet. Literally a pain in my backside. Oh, I'm a pain. You're the pain. No, you are. No, you are. No, you are. You are. No, you are. No, is that what are. we sound you like? Are. You are. Come on. All this bickering is driving me crazy. It's like wearing a beehive on your head. Can you imagine having to listen to this for more than an hour? Or two weeks? From Weird. The back of a yeah. Wagon. How bizarre. <laughs> I guess. Hop <laughs> deal. <laughs> Just spit, dude. I'm surprised now, that they don't shake tongues, too, honestly. Which. Blind to 
argumentative. Maybe it's a weird sentence, but you know what I mean, because they, instead of using their hands, they just, you get what I mean. Not my fault. You've got such a humongous swollen head, brother. Hey, now that's uncalled for. Take this. Oh, yeah, that's like a big bite, too. Jesus. Like me best. That's because she had terrible taste. The whole mountain comes down. So I guess I mean they were the ones that put the signs up and everything. Promise me we never end up like that. Us? Are you kidding? We're way too good of a team. Bring it in, buddy. I would love for this to be a moment like of where they help. are, Where's you know, they work as a team forever, yeah, but be here by now. I just, I know that they're going to bicker again. I just, I know it in my heart. And you'll be glad to know we've decided to stop up. I don't care. I need you to fill the silences. Hop Hop can't deal with them. He can't deal with them. Oh, hey kids, didn't see you there. How'd the trials go? It was fun. Fair, Except on the long road trip, I mean, and you'll be glad to know, you know, we decided to stop all that noise break. would probably anyway, bother me. We were just getting into the nitty gritty. Now that you guys are back, we can talk about and I feel like the animation again. for the house and everything, it looks different. Like, it kind of looks more crisp in a way. I don't know if that's a good way to describe it or not, but it just seems more crisp. Oh, hi. Hello. Yes. So you're fine. You're back. That took me a second to process, like, what is... I was not expecting that at all. Oh, okay. So she's back, and she's mad at them. And she's got a scar? So she's ready to fight them again. She's all ready. Oh my gosh. Well, next so what the Wait. Oh, her phone. I was like, I think you're suspicious. No! Wow. Randy so what, he too? lost <laughs> Everyone the really kingdom? Is, is he no longer in charge? Is she going to be in charge? She's going to take over, isn't she? You're sitting here binge watching trash TV all day when we're supposed to be training. Oh, man, I landed on my favorite horn. <laughs> Percy Braddock, why yeah. were you? Welcome Sasha back. thought a little action might help you get out of your rut. So you staged this attack? Sounds like you Treason. two belong <gasps> on Suspicion Island. <laughs> Hey, you so guys he want to join me? He's Seasons done, dude. Just he's done. Oh, heck no. I mean, he's got to come back, you but two go into town I can't believe this is how he is right now. I need a word with Captain. All but two of my soldiers have abandoned us. We so where is the third girl? The like, oh, where so is it, she? You're just going to sit here and do nothing? Well, I'm sure I can still lick whoever Newtopia sins after me. <laughs> I don't know, man. Right he do that. be looking kind of rough. Dude, if we got a Sasha-centric episode here, I'd be so happy. That's somebody new. Okay. I suppose you're wondering oh. who I am. Like, not especially. <laughs> Whoa. My name yeah, I mean, is like, General Yuna, scourge of the Sand Wars, defeater of Ragnar the Wretched, and the youngest newt to ever achieve the rank of general in the great Newtopian army. Great. So we have like a cocky young. Yeah. So she's not gonna. And she's not taking out crime. I hate coming out. The toad warrior that started out as a gladiator. So you know of my quarry? Tell yeah, me. Just because they. Just seen? because they know what? of crime doesn't mean they know okay? him. I don't know, but talk about a workout. I'm starving. I am General Yunan, scourge of the Sand Wars, <sighs> defeater of Nobody Ragnar the Wretched, you, the youngest youth to ever achieve the rank of general in the Great Newtopian Army. Neats. Okay, so Newtopia okay. might not I'm actually here. be the place that we want to go. I don't know, man. Tool. They seem kind of imperialistic, no which may not be good for uh, our no, friends. Sorry, never at seen all. it before. Good thing we're such good actors, huh? Yeah, now she'll never find him at the old mill, which is on the edge of town. <laughs> no, definitely won't okay, find so him. First of all, for sure. This beard and burping situation, unacceptable. Secondly, is she gonna have to? Sasha's gonna have to fight this assassin. Well, general, I guess. I guess she's not technically an assassin, right? All right, third time today. Let's do it. I <sighs> am General Yunnan, scourge of the Sand Wars. Defeat. Where's your army? I had an army once. They and now she doesn't need me. Down. Yeah, why is the like the neck oh, vein, the eyes popping? Really yeah, I think it's time to. I don't know that Sasha's up for that battle. I don't think. I don't think that she's quite ready. Enough. 
At least be honest about why you throw yourself into your training. What are you talking about? Hello? It's a distraction. You're using it to keep your mind off the real reason you're upset. Which is Look, that what? I know what? why I'm upset. I'm upset because I lost the duel at Toad Tower, aka the biggest fight of my life. Oh, please! <laughs> she almost died, too. I mean, like, she fight. almost actually died. You're upset because you lost your friend. You're upset that Anne stood up to you and that things between you will never be the same again. You don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, so, sir, look no, out. he's right. Listen, Not gonna there's another reason why I've been training so hard. Yeah, what's up? To protect the one person I know I can count on right now. Is it Marcy? You. Oh! Right. I already lost one friend. Oh! I'm not about to lose another. That's... Wow. I friends? didn't see that coming. Yeah, no, that was not what I... I... Wow. I thought it was gonna be like, yeah, I think her name is Marcy, at least. I was like... You know, protect the one friend that we haven't found yet. Honestly, yes. Repetition helps it stick. If you want me, General, you'll have to fight both of us. Why not? After all, two hey, heads are better she, than one. She got rid of her army, brother. I don't know that, like... Welcome back, Captain. Thank you, Lieutenant, for reminding me that I've still got something worth fighting for. Oh. I'm talking about our friendship. Not sure if you caught that. I got it. Now, come I on. love that, though. I mean, like, I love that they're friends. I don't know that I love that it's, you know, if, you know that they're evil and stuff, but I love that they're friends. Sasha, I suppose, deserves friendships in this stuff. dastardly realm. I, I will admit, this season so far, infinitely better than season one. Imme like, well, immediately. Are you this is already putting season one to shame, and I mean that in the most respectful way possibly. I still enjoyed it. World building. I explain all that in episode one, but like, this is great, dude. Shoot. What did you say your name was again? I forgot. <laughs> I am General Yonan, scourge of the Sand Wars, defeater of Ragnar the Wretched, the youngest mute ever to be made. <gasps> oh! You can swim! This cannot be! I am General Yonan! You were oh, yeah. General Yonan? Maybe? That was <laughs> an effective way to get rid of her. And first lieutenant to Captain Grime. God, she's kind of like Captain Anne, Grime. but a more like psychotic Grime. version of Anne. <laughs> like her hyperness. <laughs> Goodbye, General Yunan. I am fired up. Forget retaking the valley. Forget serving the kingdom at all. How about you and I raise a frog dang army and storm the capital? It's high time a toad ruled this world so for we're a gonna change. Have a That's what I'm talking Treason. about. Treason. But before we take over the An world, insurrection. You totally want to binge the rest of Suspicion Island. I really do. Wow. Well, yeah. <laughs> Looks like I've got my own path now, Anne. But it's not over between us. <sighs> Not even close. Yeah, no, the scar, dude. Yeah. Oh, man. It's good. That's good. We're, like, really getting into this. As I was saying during the episode, this season so far has kicked off much quicker than I thought it was going to. I, the, the things that we're talking about already are not things that I thought we would see until episodes maybe 10 or even up to 15. And I don't really know what would have happened in those previous 10 or 15 episodes, but I just wasn't expecting this level of hype to be happening so early. But it's really exciting because it does show me that this show is just going to keep ramping up and that we're going to have this like epic conclusion and I'm super super excited for that seeing Sasha so early in the season and seeing her like train and have this motivation to I, like I don't know exactly what her plan for Anne is I don't know if she you know wants to exact revenge by way of you know killing her or something of that nature but I'm excited to see how that's going to turn out and how long it'll be before the roads cross I'm pretty sure that the third friend's name is Marcy. I could be wrong. I feel like they've either said it or I've seen it somewhere or something, but I'm very curious as to when she's gonna show up. I am actually surprised that it's even taken this long. I thought that maybe if anything, we would have gotten that teased in an earlier episode for this season, but we're only four episodes in. So it's not like, you know, it's not like things need to move much quicker than that. I think for the episode three, I'm gonna throw a 
I want to throw like a four out of five stars to that episode. I think that that's something I would definitely rewatch multiple times. I love Polly. She's probably my favorite character. So there's definitely some bias in there with, you know, whether I'm willing to rewatch something or not. And that episode was just... It's just a good time, you know, it's a very, very good time. And then the second episode four, episode three, was also fun. Could have had some more things in there. I didn't really care for the acting story a whole lot. There wasn't really, there just wasn't really anything super exciting in there for me. So I don't think it's an episode that I re rewatch a ton, millions of times, but I would re over but I would rewatch it for the poly part. Episode four though, I'm gonna throw, I think, I'm gonna throw another four out of five stars to it. I really liked the Sasha episode. That was definitely my favorite of those two uh, parts, but the sibling rivalry very much speaks to me. So it's kind of hard to pick like, you know, which one was my favorite of those, but I really enjoyed the Sasha part. I'm saying a four out of five stars to it though, because it's definitely rewatchable, but the, the moment with Sprig and Polly, I genuinely, I'm pretty sure that that episode is gonna mean nothing in a few episodes in the sense that I don't think that they're gonna stop bickering. You know, this has been going on for a season and, you know, some change now, but also siblings don't really just stop bickering. So I feel like that, that episode was more of just like a, hey, here's, you know, one of those episodes that you can enjoy and not really have a lot behind it. The Sasha episode though, I feel like there's some consequence in there and it's just a very enjoyable episode, but I would love to hear what you guys thought of the episode as well so let me know down in the comments as always and if you've not subscribed yet make sure that you do that so that way you can come back and watch these episodes day one and if you'd like to catch them early or watch the entirety of season two early because it is all available on patreon you can get access to that by becoming a patron which will also give you access to steven universe along with some other stuff don't forget to follow me on these channels as well so that we can stay updated with the channel or check out some of the other stuff i've got going on like twitch and discord i would love to see you guys in those spaces as well so we could discuss amphibia in a way that is not through YouTube comments because sometimes those are very difficult to keep up with, especially when we're doing as many episodes as we are. So I'd love to see you in those spaces as well. But until next time, thanks for watching.